Good morning, everyone. Okay. Today we're discussing artificial intelligence possibilities for English teachers. Let's look at the first example, creating sentences that target specific aspects of grammar. Rowan, what do you think? Extremely useful. Once you can quickly create a list of sentences on any aspect of grammar, it becomes very easy to create all kinds of exercises. For example, you can create gap fills or matching exercises with meanings, pictures, examples, and so on. Exactly. Nice answer. I think you've been teaching for a while, as you immediately see the possibilities. All right, let's go further. What about this one, Aaliyah? Creating questions for a specific aspect of grammar. In this case, the example is frequency adverbs. Oh, wonderful. Teaching grammar can be quite boring sometimes, and being able to instantly create a list of questions to go with any grammar activity is, wow, quite amazing. That means that any time my students get bogged down in grammar, I can wake them up with a speaking activity. And I don't have to worry about the headache of creating the questions myself. Yes, great point. Using AI can greatly reduce the stress and headaches of creating teaching materials. So, let's move on to example three. Reading comprehension questions. Jaden, did this surprise you? Artificial intelligence can create questions about any article or story you input. And not just ordinary questions, but multiple choice questions too. Yes, yes. This did surprise me. Particularly the multiple choice questions. My immediate thoughts were this can really help me create interesting reading exercises and exams quickly. It would save me a lot of time and a lot of stress. Not only that, I could create more interesting reading exercises as I can spend more time looking for interesting content for my students. Okay, I totally agree. This seems to be a really cool feature. And number four is its ability to provide answers to those questions. Kayla, is that useful too? Yes, of course. When you are quickly preparing teaching materials, creating the answers can be an annoying, tedious task. Getting the AI to create the answers can help you be prepared. And also it gives you an opportunity to review the questions and check whether they are suitable or not. Also, it might help you weed out confusing, boring or pointless questions. Your role as teacher can become more of a creator. Hmm. Interesting and impressive. We are clearly looking at a new type of teacher. So the fifth example of AI for assisting teachers is creating a conversation. Remy, it's your turn. Well, I think this is really good. Especially if you are a listening speaking teacher. It gives you the opportunity to experiment with conversations. You can refresh the AI until you come up with the perfect dialogue. You might want to include specific words or phrases. Or you could think of new questions that make the conversation more interesting. Or you might want to add interjections that make it sound more natural. And also, you want a conversation that is easy enough for your students. So, I have to say, I think that being able to customize a conversation for a specific group of students is pretty amazing. Yes, I can see that. It seems that you will be using this feature of AI a lot. That's for sure. This was an ESL Flow production.